Hello everyone and welcome to my reaction to Kangen Omega chapter 128. This is the first time I've done a reaction to a Kangen chapter thanks to the new official English translations we are getting on Kamaki. Uh, I am sitting here waiting as the last few seconds tick down before the chapter releases. Um, I do... I, I think... I know at least one thing, like I've narrowly dodged some spoilers. I'm just really excited for this. Let's get into it. Chapter 128, it was you. Let's see here. Okay, so we have Wakatsuki, who seems to have just regained consciousness. My god, does he look absolutely fucking terrible. Uh, we have some doctors attending to him. He's awake. What about the match? We need a stretcher. Did I lose? I like how that's the first thing Waka wants to know. He's very concerned about that. Hey, stay still, Pops. We have Rihito. Okay, so... Here, here, I know we have, like, the actual names now. Um, like, they're, they're gonna change Galang to Kalang. Lalong's gonna be Rolan. I'm still gonna call them the old names because I'm never gonna get used to what the official names are. But I know there's the difference. I know if Lalong's actual name is Rolan, that means he's probably French instead of Filipino, which kind of changes, like, all of the theories about his martial arts. But anyway, we have Rahito and Agito here looking over him. It was a draw. Okay, so it was what I expected. It seems it counted as a double knockdown according to purgatory rules. A draw? Never thought I'd see you get your ass kicked like this. You were up against one hell of a monster. True, but he's not as lucky as you are. It's not your fault. Those are his just desserts for infringing on God's domain. Jesus Christ. Okay, so Faye is like barely alive right now. We have Carlos and Liu here over him as the doctors are trying to attend to him. Um, Faye, pull yourself together. You can't die yet. You're too young to die. I don't know if I expected something. Oh, Carlos is like one of the older members of Purgatory, so I don't know. This doesn't look good. There's nothing we can do for him. Whoever was close to Faye, can you get in touch with his relatives? He doesn't have much time left. No. But why? Why did this have to happen? Did you hear that, Nino? Do you have any last words? You must have one last thing to say to someone. A relative, a lover, a friend, anyone. I'll pass it along for you. I swear to God. Holy shit. This is a really good moment for Carlos here. Well, let's see. These are his last moments. This is going to be the defining moment for Faye's character. This is, this is his last time on Earth. What does he have to say? Let go of me. I'm not into men. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. I don't have anyone I'm close to, and I don't believe in God either. But since you're kind enough to offer, I'll take you up on it. Bring me to Kita Oma. Oh boy. Now this is very interesting. Hey, this is the first time we've talked face to face, isn't it? What's this about? I didn't ask for you to, and we have Yamashita and Koga up here with them. You're a worm, aren't you? Of course we'd be wary of you. You better not try anything funny. Ha! Huh. If I could, I would have done it already. But I can't even lift a finger. I'm on death's door. This is even more dramatic than when Nidon died. That was one of the most, like, extended dramatic character deaths we've had. I'm almost- I'm kind of surprised we're actually getting this. What did you want to say to me? Nothing, really. I just wanted to congratulate you. You will soon be the sole practitioner of the Nico style apart from Nico himself. Congratulations, you are now the Tiger's Vessel. So is the Tiger's Vessel just the heir to the Nico style? Like, the ideal heir? I heard someone else say that word once before. You're students of the other Nico, aren't you? Does the Tiger's Vessel have something to do with the Nico style? No shit, Oma. The Tiger's Vessel refers to Takeda Nico's heir. Well, yeah. Nico will pass on all his techniques and knowledge to whoever he recognizes as the Tiger's Vessel. Such a shame. I could have reached even higher heights if I'd been the Tiger's Vessel. What? He was so powerful already, but he still wanted more? Hey, is Ryuki in the running for this Tiger's Vessel thing too? That's a very good question, Koga. I'm very glad you asked that. Gao Ryuki? I thought he might be at first myself and that's why he wanted to kill him. But he doesn't use the Nico style. He's not qualified to be the Tiger's Vessel. You can't 
become the vessel just by having the same genes. You need to know the techniques to- Oh, is this confirm- Oh, we're confirming he's a clone here. The hell do you mean? <laughs> Haven't you started to piece it together yet? Two men who came from nowhere, both with the same face. Your clones made by the worm. Didn't Jia Ji give you that new heart of yours? Wait, so Oma is also a clone of someone? So, so? Who am I a copy of? Whoever he is, he must have been handsome. Not wrong. How the hell should I know? But whoever he is, he's privileged enough to receive organ farming services. Oh my god. So he's got to be someone of pretty high status. Maybe Yan? Maybe it's the head of the worm? Wait, when you put it that way... Hold on a second. I've never seen his face up close before, but you're... No, this has to be a joke. Could the tiger's vessel really be... This can't be real, but it all makes so much sense. The real tiger's vessel is... Hey, what are you talking about? Don't fucking interrupt him! Don't interrupt him. I can't make heads or tails of what you're saying. <laughs> of course you wouldn't. Yes, you couldn't understand. Okay, he's laughing like an asshole. The thought would never even cross your mind. You sure pulled the wool over my eyes, Nico. Fuck you, this is bullshit. We were just... Fuck. Fuck. What the hell did I... What's wrong? He's delirious. Nico, I'll fucking kill you. You fucked me over. Fuck you. Faye, what's wrong? What are you talking about? Oh, he grabs Oma? The tiger's vessel, it was you all along. And then he's dead. Oma. The three fists toad, Fei Wang Fang, is deceased. So it looks like the leaks were right. I can't believe Daro. Did, did Daro really accidentally leak this on stream? That's kind of unfortunate. Well, uh, how many pages do we have left? A few. Are we going to get an entrance this chapter or what? No. So my final test subject is dead. I have all the data I need for this Nico style to evolve even further. Okay, so Tiger Nico is walking away. He has blood dripping off of him. Uh, yeah, Mutaba is probably dead. He's probably dead. And that was the chapter. Well, son of a bitch, we didn't get Lelong entering today, but I, I guess this was kind of like when Nidon died, you had like a whole chapter dedicated to it. I guess that's better than Faye just passing away off screen. And he was a fairly important guy, so I guess we kind of needed to get that information out of him, so. Anywho, um, yeah, that was, that was chapter 128. What did you guys think of it? I'll have a review out later today. Uh, it'll be just like the jujitsu situation. Uh, if you enjoyed, be sure to like, leave a comment, check out our Discord server if you enjoyed discussing hanging with other people, uh, and uh, you should check out my Patreon if you want to help support me and the channel directly. I'm going to save shoutouts for reviews and stuff. I'd prefer these reactions be a little more informal. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys around. Take care.